We now know the name of the man police are searching for in the brutal shooting death of a father and son. This is video of the murders has been circulating online. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor is in East Flatbush with an update. 47-year-old Vladimir Mathurin and his 27-year-old stepson, Chinwei Mood, were shot dead Sunday night, police say, by their downstairs neighbor, 47-year-old Jason Pass, who they had an ongoing noise dispute with. A video camera on the fourth floor of the Flatbush Gardens complex at 1418 Brooklyn Avenue shows Pass, who lives below on the third floor, arguing with Mathurin's wife. Mathurin then comes out holding up what police say are scissors. His wife tries pulling him away as Pass then pulls out a gun. We're stopping the video here. The NYPD says Pass shoots Mathurin and Mood and calmly flees the scene. The NYPD says Pass had called 311 six times since March 2022 on his upstairs neighbors over what sounded like banging on the floor. Noise complaints, basically people walking. Uh, we come to find out the apartment upstairs didn't have carpeting. It was a wood floor, so a lot of noise. People walking back and forth generated these calls. Building management says there were numerous complaints from both apartments and that mediation was offered but never done. On Monday, CBS2 spoke with the victim's wife and mother who says Pass banged on the ceiling, so her husband banged on the floor back. My husband have no gun, no weapon. Why would bring a gun to shoot my family? Why would bring a gun to tear my family apart? Why? Why? Brooklyn Councilwoman Farrah Lewis spent some time with the grieving family. They need a lot of support right now. This, uh, her husband was her bread, the bread, breadwinner of the family. So to know that he was paying for her to go to school, paying for two children to go to a parochial school, now they have nothing. As police searched for pass, on Tuesday, anti-violence group Elite Learners, Inc. and others were outside the building to denounce gun violence. We have to come out. We have to let the world know that this is not normal and that we have resources to support those that are in need. It was completely uncalled for and senseless, and you, you took away, uh, you destroyed a family. In Flatbush, Brooklyn, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News.